poppin' y'all, welcome back to another YouTube video, and today we're taking a look at another news video, and this video is all about U2s, and all the stuff that they have to offer over the next coming days, and they do have Don't Starve, there is two new figures for Don't Starve, and I think it's the main villain and the main character, I'm not a fan of uh, Don't Starve, I have played it once on the channel, and I did die pretty much straight away, so I did starve, I did die, and um, unfortunately, I didn't play it ever again, and I don't think it was that popular of a game to deserve its own U2s, but here they are with two new U2s, and what game does deserve U2s is Doki Doki Literature Club. There is a picnic date where if you buy all four characters, you can set them out on a nice picnic sort of display, with each one of them having one part of the picnic blanket. We also have the Kitty Cupcake plush, and a couple of other plushes for um you twos as well each one of these figures does cost around 25 to 35 pounds just based on actual pricing and the plushes are also 35 to 45 pounds as well because they're a lot bigger and obviously a lot harder to make than the other figures and we do have mr cow and mr bird and i don't like how mr cow looks he's staring at me funny and i don't like how his udders are pointing at me we also have um a racing outfit for the cat which we got a couple of weeks ago we got a collaboration between these guys uh, a couple of weeks ago and now we have some more with uh, tempbot and then an alternative version of tempbot which has a massive wacky grin on his face and it is the portal one which i think is quite co cool cute and unique it's not like the others but oh well it's still here for a new figure and i like that i'm all here for it we also have a bit of a look at the next wave of hell, hell of a boss um u2s with the drawing of millie um so hopefully we get moxie as well but they are the potential designs we also have basic history here as an army man and then we also have a really cool one of my favorite creator u2s it is the blue flame guy i don't know who he is i don't know what he is but he looks absolutely incredible and one figure that i do want to get because i think he'll look badass on a shelf we also have another plush for another creator i don't know what he makes i don't know what he is but he does look like um a little bit of a, a demon here with his hood up um very fluffy hood by the way might i add but he's also wearing a flannel shirt and some ripped jeans. We also have Dan TDM getting his own plushes. He does have a plush of himself and then a pug plush as well as a Five Nights at Freddy's tie-in figure, which is, I do believe, Glam Dan TDM, like Glam Rock Dan TDM, um, like Glam Rock Freddy, but Glam Rock Dan TDM. Here's a better look at the front of the plushes, um, which I'm not a big fan of the U2's plushes, I'm gonna be honest. I think they're a little overpriced, a little expensive, and I just don't have the taste for them. I much prefer the figures. And this Dan TDM figure looks incredible with the tiny little pugs dancing around him as well. It is just one of the better Dan TDM U2s and it does look quite cool. I do like it. We also have a tease for another character, which I do believe is a TikToker who makes sort of um, quite a few memes that I've seen. And we do have the official look of it here and it is a really detailed pop and they they are holding the belt ready to whoop your ass and we do have uncle roger coming again with some new funko not funko u2s here with bubble tea i thought he was genuinely taking a bath in this one i wasn't that sure that he was um bubble tea but he is bubble tea Uncle Roger also has his own plush coming out, which I think is really cool, and I really do like his orange hoodie there, but he does have a full collection of a figure and a plush, and I do believe he's holding rice. I could be wrong, but I do like the bubble tea one. I think it's quite cute, and how he's sort of standing out the bubble tea, sort of chomping down on one, although it would pop and the juice would go everywhere, and it'd be very sticky. We also have a front-facing look of the plushes that we took a look at last U2's video. And then we also have another character which is very resemblant of Sailor Moon, but it is a TikToker or YouTuber. I'm not too familiar with who it is, but I do believe they're coming out uh, quite shortly, so we should have official looks at her soon, and not just her shadows and her sort of back uh, images. We do also have a plush for this character and a pin set, so... I'm not too sure if this is a content creator or a game character, but it is very, very heavily inspired by Sailor Moon, just based on the outfits and how the hair is. And, um, yeah, I, I'm not too interested in any of these, 
but uh, we do have another YouTuber wearing a safari outfit, which is Jojo Thamofo, um, who's got some capybaras, which is quite cute. And then we also have our first look at Shadow Mangle, and that is all the YouTube news that I have for you today. And if you do want to go check out Thankmas, do check the first link in the description. And if you want to check out anything else that I have to offer, please do check out the second link in the description because that will take you to all the other stuff that I have um, if you want a little bit more to the price in your life. So other than that, hope you enjoyed and goodbye.